Hello friends, I'm Colonel Failure and this is Derail Valley, uh, the brand new kind of train simulator kind of game uh, with, uh, with more of a leaning towards the Euro truck kind of style of simulation. Um, it's a VR game primarily, but I'm not playing this in VR, I'm playing it in 2D, which you can also do. Um, and uh, and it, it still works pretty well. It's very, very early access at the moment. It all works, sort of. Um, but, uh, but yeah, there's a, there's a long way to go before this is a, a proper stable release. Uh, anyway, today we're going to go, uh, we're going to take this diesel out here for a bit of a, a bit of a shunting action kind of adventure. And uh, why not stick around and watch that happen? Right, I've done the tutorial, so I've got my train driver's license, which lives here. Look at that, I'm a train driver's license, licensed train driver, uh, which is magnificent. And this is actually one of my favourite features of the uh, of the game at the moment, is that uh, you can bring up your, uh, your guidebook for just about anything, uh, any time you please. It keeps you, it keeps you in sim as it were, rather than uh, referring to uh, to external documentation, uh, which is rather marvellous. What I like even better than that is if I call up the station map here, uh, we can, uh, in fact, if I'm going to, uh, I'm heading down to the steel mill, so we'll uh, we'll bring that up, uh, but then we'll just, we'll fling it on the desk here. Uh, and then it's uh, available for you to look at any time you please. Um, which is just a really nice, uh, a really nice feature. Obviously tailored towards VR because you've got your crash helmet on, and therefore uh, you, you're not going to be able to go and look at something else easily. So having things that you can just kind of leave hanging around is actually kind of cool. Uh, right, let's get the uh, let's get the engine started here. So fuses, uh, all right, and then uh, crank it. No, other way, other way. That's it. Go on. There we go. We are cranked. Uh, we're operational. Uh, here's my reverser. We'll bang that into uh, into forwards. Brakes already off. Uh, let's give it a let's give it a bit of get up and go. Uh, now we're going to obviously have to do a reversing maneuver uh, once we get up towards the buffers. There, uh, that's fine. That's perfectly within my uh, my capabilities. And obviously, if I feel like uh, jumping off at any point, I can. Um, this is all, uh, you know, I can I can go pretty much wherever I like, whenever I feel like it, uh, which is absolutely dandy. Anyway, we're going to pull this up to the buffer, just get past the points here, and uh, and then we'll uh, do a quick switcheroo. Uh, now, as the name suggests, yeah, I hit the buffers, but uh, that's what they're there for. Uh, as the name suggests, derailing is very much a possibility uh, in this adventure. I've not done it yet. Um, but apparently it can be quite spectacular. I'm not going to do it deliberately. Uh, if you like this one, we'll have another go at some point, and then uh, uh, and then you can have um, you can have some some derailed train action. Uh, right now, I don't know if there's enough room to back all the way into the engine shed there. In which case, we might have to uh, to shove that other one out of the way a little bit. Uh, but that's okay. I'm sure it'll I'm sure it'll comply. Uh, right, back it up. And as you can see, the flag on the signal on the uh, on the points there indicates which way you should go. And you've possibly given that a little bit too much juice. There you are. Right. How much space we got? Oh, we've got loads of space. It's fine. All right, give it some break. That'll stop us. Oh, there you go. Give it a bit of a shove. I I don't I put that there. That that wasn't left by the game. No, that one that one was all me. I should probably go and apply the break. Uh, just to stop it from um, from doing that again, and uh, yeah, there we go. You see, right? It's telling me it's in range at the moment because I could couple the two together, uh, but at the moment I don't think you can uh, you can daisy chain the control. So uh, I would need to basically jump from loco to loco in order to uh, to keep the power synchronized and the brakes. It's not going to work. Uh, right? This actually looks wrong so uh, let's uh, let's ping the points here there you go right okay that's that uh, where are we going oh yeah that's the other weakness that I found you know how I stuck the station map on there yeah it's gone straight back into my inventory when I jumped off the train as long as you stay on the train whatever you've dropped will stay there uh, I've thrown away this is another weakness I found early on is uh, is that I filled my inventory up to the point where uh, uh, where I had no space left, and therefore when I picked up a job, I couldn't carry it. 
um, which was uh, which was which was somewhat tricky. Um, but uh, but anyway, we're going. To, it's only a little bit down the rails. You'll, we won't be long. Um, uh, we're gonna we're gonna head out here and uh, and go get ourselves a job because uh, we're a, we're a jobbing engineer and and with the money that you get from jobs you can unlock uh, new licenses and that's about it for the moment. Um, I don't know where they're planning to take the game, uh, but if in the future you were able to I don't know buy your own industries or uh, hire AI drivers to do some work or or whatever. Uh, you know, like you would in, in maybe farm sim. Well, that'd be that'd be quite something. Um, right, there we go. So, uh, so I mean, everything works. You know, we could bang the cab lights on, which is probably a good idea. Stick the fan on, obviously. Not entirely sure where the fan is, but having it on makes me feel more comfortable uh, about life anyway. Right, so here we are. Coming up, this is the steel mill. Uh, we're going to stay on the main line here and pull up just next to that white building there because that's the station office and that's where we'll go to pick up our uh, our first job of the day now if we get past one job today I'd be rather surprised uh, right let's go and just park it up here could have parked better than that but uh, that'll do uh, right off we go you don't need to worry about opening doors and stuff like that at the moment they just kinda let you drift through them merrily um, and you can uh, quickly jump on board anything you like at any point. Uh, now, you'll see, actually, we'll, we'll do a quick walk here. Um, I don't have the license for that loco yet, uh, but but I'm leaving that for you for a, for a supplemental episode, you see? A supplementary, uh, additional, a further episode uh, would lead us towards driving this fella. Ooh, yummy. Uh, I think I've actually got the cash to do it now. I've got two grand. Hold on, let's check the wallet. Uh, we've got, yeah, I've got two grand at the moment, um, and therefore getting another license isn't far beyond my grasp at the current time, he says confidently. Uh, we're about to find out exactly how much I need to get the uh, the steam train license, and that is, all right, unlocks jobs with longer trains, okay, that's eight grand. Secret vehicle, 65. 20k, okay. All right, and then another 50 bucks to get the instruction manual. Right, uh, we've got to do some work then. Um, so here's the uh, the overall map, and obviously I carry this around with me as well. Uh, we're at the uh, we're at the steel mill uh, at the current time, uh, which, as you can see, is pretty much dead center in the map uh, there. And uh, we are going to go somewhere else. But we'll find out where. And then you get uh, the uh, the industry chain that is going on. I don't know what the importance of that is at the current time. I suspect there is something something afoot there. Anyway, here are the jobs. Right, okay. So what have we got here? This will pay eight grand. Uh, I could pick I, I could just pick them up. I mean they're meaningless until I've uh, until I've done anything with it, you know, throw it on the floor. Oh flipping heck. That's the VR games for you. Uh, you just just sling it down there. And what I'm looking for I'm just I'm looking for something that is about right uh, for a bit of video work here. There you go. What's this? Uh, if I could do this in 10 minutes, uh, that's good. All right. What have we got to do? Uh, I need to grab uh, CFF 052 and 53. Yeah. On the S9 track. Uh, and then uh, load the following cars with cargo. Don't know how to do that, but we'll we'll give it a go. Uh, and then uncouple. And then jo and jobs are good. All right, okay, I'll take it. Yeah, no, uh, stick that one in me uh, in me list. Right, so uh, put it back up again because you've forgotten what you're doing. Um, uh, C double F O five two and five three. Uh, that's not these pair, is it? No, that's C B K. Uh, they all handily have their uh, their reference number on the side there. Uh, on where are we? Uh, track O twelve. No, you're, you're too far ahead. Back up a couple of pages. There you go. Right. All right, well, where are you then? C double F. There we go. Hold on. What's that? That's a C double F. That's 29. I could look up the track, of course, and that would probably help me. But uh, I'm on foot. I like a bit of a stroll once in a while. I might as well, uh, might as well do this manually. There we go. 
C double F O five two, and that will be five three, hopefully, next to it. Right. Well, I've got all of this gubbins in the way as well. Uh, now then, it's, I think this is a... Is, uh, can I come at this from the other end? I think I probably can. Um, if I put that away and bring up the station map, uh, like so. Right, okay, so on 09, yes, we can. Uh, right, so we'll shoot past that and then come back and, uh, and get what we need. Piece of cake, really. Easy peasy, even. Uh, right. Okay. Now, smashing piece of cake. No problem. I've got this. This is uh, this is all totally under control. Um, I probably could have looked that up just by looking it up, uh, but uh, but old trusty here. Yeah, a quick quick teleport. You know, we'll uh, we'll cut out some of the the mindless running around there. Right. Let's belt it down past the junction, and then we'll. I'm wheel spinning. Wheel spinning. Ease it down, and then there you go. Uh, it's got plenty of get up and go, uh, this little diesel. Um, but, uh, you know, you, you want to be gentle with it. Uh, now, engine temperature, need to keep an eye on the engine, engine temperature uh, because uh, uh, you can get a little bit overheated if you're, uh, if you're doing too much action. We want to avoid doing too much action if at all possible so we avoid overheating. There you go, I can give it a bit more now. There you are. Uh, right, so if I understood that schematic properly, and that's never a foregone conclusion. Uh, what are we rolling over on? We're, going, we're switching over by two lines. Okay, fine. Uh, so we'll whiz past here. Actually, hold on, no, slow it down, slow it down, slow it down. Let's get my, uh, my junction remote. And we want to, uh, to ping... Uh, which way do we want to go? We want to ping that one. Ah, I missed it. Never mind. Okay, right. Well, put, tell you what, put that away. Drive the train a bit. There you go. Brake. On. Right. Uh, now, I'm going to hop off. I'm going to... Uh, yes, I could do this while on the go if I was moving very slowly, but I'm, I'm going to be a little bit cautious. Uh, bring up my junction remote again. Ping that one. Go on. Go on. Ping it. There you go. And then the one next to it as well, if I can. No, no, no. It's... We've still only got the first one there. All right, all right, okay. Because you want to see me change while we're on the go, we'll we'll do it while we're in motion. Uh, right, put that away. Uh, you've got to brake on. You've got to throttle off. Bang it in reverse. There you go. Uh, now, if you've played any kind of train simulation before, all of this is very intuitive. Uh, how realistic it is, don't really know. But uh, in terms of understanding the controls from the get-go, piece of cake. There are no keyboard shortcuts for the controls at the current time. Um, you, you have to do it all by grabbing it and hoiking it around, but that's how I prefer to do it anyway. So uh, so that's all good. Now, what about this second set? What's going on there? We don't want to go that way, so we want to change that switch. That's it. And that should be it. Although, where have they just come from? You weren't there a minute ago. Hold on, stick the brakes on. Make sure I'm going up the right one. Uh, turn that off. Stick these on. Right, track nine. So, I mean, I've set myself to swerve around that one, and that looks possibly track nine. Hold on. The, the, the tracks are signposted. Uh, so, you are... That's ten. So, this is nine. Which means that these lot have just turned up. Well, that's a pain in the bum, because I don't want those. I want the one next to it. Or have they just turned up? Am I, am I just mistaken? I could, I could look at the job again. Let's look at the job again. Uh, yep, bring that up. Uh, okay. It's a low, no, load. That's load. Go back to page one, page one please. Shunting do job, yes. Uh, SLO5, yes. Uh, pick those up. Load and prepare a train with steel billets and steel bend plates. Okay. SLO5, that's where we are. I've got to go find CFF again. Is it these two? Because if it is, I'm not sure. Well, I'm going to have to, I'm going to, have to move this stuff out of the way. Apparently, I'll get a bonus if I do this within 10 minutes. Fat chance. Um, when you've got extra wagons just appearing out of thin air. 
Uh, I did mention that this was early access. That welcome to some earlyish access behaviour. Uh, this is it, isn't it? Yeah, that's 5.3. Oh, brilliant. Thanks for that. Right, CBK054 and onwards. We want to uh, we want to shift them around. Okay, fine. I can do that. That's probably something I can do. Can we get... A, I'm going to teleport over to my train as soon as I get the opportunity. There you go. Whoop. <coughs> and then walk off the, 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 the wrong end. Uh, right, okay. Well, as you were... You were doing everything correctly. The uh, the game just decided to throw you a curveball there. Right, there you go. Back it up. I think we can be a little bit more aggressive than that. There you go. Let's give it some horn. Whoa, gently. This is going to hurt. Ah, it's got it. Right, now then. Uh, what we do now is we say... Uh, we use the, the, the dialer down here... All right, now then, we want to uncouple, because I don't want to bring all of them. I didn't count, did I? Counting the number to uncouple would have been a would have been a good move. Uh, right, well, uh, where, are we, where are we going? Oh, it's quite a few. Okay, uh, one, yes, two, yes, three, yeah, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. All right. Probably. We'll find out that I'm wrong in due course. Uh, right, so go back to my dialer down here. And uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, six. Keep going. Seven. Yeah. Eight. Yeah. Nine. Ten. Eleven. Right. So we, we decouple at that point. Yes. Don't know. Not tried this before. I've not tried <laughs> not tried splitting a consist. If we haven't got enough, or we've got one too many, we'll we'll work on that. But uh, right, brakes off. Bang it in forwards. Off we trot. Just gently. There we go. So we're now we're now hauling, as you can plainly see. Uh, we've got you know we've got some bits and pieces on there. I've no idea if I've got the right number or not at the current time. Um, if I slow this down, I should be able to teleport back to the cab. Uh, this possibly goes a little bit against uh, best uh, best practice, but uh, we'll have a look anyway. Have I got it? I have. I think I've got it right. Yep. Stranger things have happened, uh, but I have got it right. There we go. Teleport back in. Cheating. Uh, but uh, that's all good. Uh, right, so we're going to have to wiggle a fair bit past this junction. What I'm planning to do is I'm going to back it up and stick it on another siding. Because that's what you do. Uh, then I'll go grab the two that I need, take them to where I need them to be taken, and uh, load them up, and all of that kind of business there. All right, come on, I think we can go a bit faster than this, can't we? I'm guessing maybe we can't. All right, so we just get, need to get clear of the junction... No idea from that side. Whoop, don't fall off. Falling off would be bad. Okay, oh, I've got oh, I had a, I had for a moment there a bit of a read as to whether I've got that right or not. Uh, right, let's ease that off. We must be getting close if we haven't done it already. There we go. Right, let's go and have a quick look. Oh, no, no, I think there might still be... No, I think we're there. Uh, in fact, it looks like I might have uh, I might have timed that absolutely spot on. Uh, right, we'll change the junction over now, um, given that the wagons will already be in, uh, in the process of heading towards wherever it is I'm shoving them uh, before I get a chance to, uh, to adjust me... Uh, uh, whatchamacallit, bearing. No, you're not quite there. You need to go a little bit further. Oh, bum. Or do you? No, no, no. Actually, you've you've done that better than you anticipated, even if it was somewhat accidental. Right, so we'll change this one. Right, good. There's, there should be enough room... Wait, wait for it. Uh, there should be enough room in there for uh, for this load. Uh, and then we just have to, uh, have to hope that the game hasn't slung some more wagons in to make life difficult. Um, 
because if it has, we're not we're not going to get any further with this. If it keeps going, oh, those wagons have disappeared. Tell you what, let's bang some more in. You kind of go, no, don't bang any more in. That's that's not what we want at all. Uh, the other way of doing it, of course, would be to take the other end uh, of the uh, of this uh, of this consist and um, uh, and then separate the uh, the two leading kind of box cars that we've got going. Well, they're not boxes, are they? They're hoppers. Uh, separate them off, and uh, oh, whatever. Right, okay, backwards, please. There you go. Give it some of that. Release this. Actually, should possibly set the throttle a little bit first. Otherwise, you know, physics. Uh, right. Okay. Go on. I think uh, a little bit more gusto than that would possibly be advisable. Jolly good. Smashing. Uh, right. Now, I mean, uh, the, the first mission that I usually take is a very straightforward... It, it pays a grand, rather like this one does. Uh, but it's two wagons that are isolated uh, that you can then uh, you, you can then just you take them around the corner basically load them up and then bring them back again. I tried that and uh, and they disappeared um, <laughs> after after I brought or no my job my job sheet disappeared uh, which meant that I couldn't cash it in. Uh, I managed to do the job but then uh, I didn't get paid for it, which was a bit disappointing. Uh, also worth noting at the moment, everything auto-saves all the time. Uh, there is no save game management uh, within uh, within Derail Valley at the current time, uh, but that is going to be one of their first, uh, one of their first goals, I believe. Um, all right, okay. Once we get past this set here, we should be able to abandon ship and, and go get the stuff that we need. Right, that'll do. We'll give it just a little bit more space so that uh, we're not crossing too far into the into the point zone. There you are. Right, good. Uh, you're giving me some flashing there. I assume that's possibly because I've just done that. There we go. Right, okay, let's deconnect. Right. And then, uh, forwards again. Uh, I, I think that the uh, the wagons are fitted with some kind of uh, majestic self-braking system. Uh, I certainly haven't seen anyone uh, give me an indication that I need to apply a brake to the wagons. Uh, so, uh, so I'm going to assume I don't need to. And there we go. I mean, they certainly take off at a reasonable lick. Uh, so if they were... Yeah, you see, I've got, I've got the fear here. I think... I think it's just spawned some more in. Uh, all right, we'll find out. Uh, switch that. Thank you. Right, now then, let's uh, set ourselves into reverse. And then wind that on a bit. Drop this off. Now, the point should still be set from when I picked up the first lot. But that's by no means a certainty. And I am seeing a bunch more wagons here. Which doubtless is going to know. You see, look, they, it's, re, it's respawned the wagons. Well, that's not helpful. No, 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 no. Give it up. Give it up. No, no, that's not going to work. That's it's not going to work. You might want to get a hustle on with this as well. Or you're just going to ram into. Well, there's that then. Um, yeah. Okay. Uh, details. Uh, right. Forwards. Okay. We're going to come at it from the other end. Right. Yeah. Let's get out of here. All right, yeah, 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 wheel slip, yeah. There you go. Come on. Right, okay, so we're going to jump over by two and then back it up down the, uh, down the, the, the kind of the main line through, uh, and then we'll, uh, then we'll get it right, possibly. Uh, all right, do that, bring up the remote. Yeah, all right, ping that one. Uh, right, put that away, bang it in reverse, lovely, take the brake off, smashing, give it the beans, off we go. Alright, fine, okay, so we had a misfire first couple of times there, that's, that's no big deal, happens to every engine driver from time to time, uh, where uh, where the universe suddenly magics up some more wagons that you're then supposed to cape, uh, cope with. Um, not in this case, uh, I moved those though, look, that was some shunting, successfully shunted. I, I, I didn't have to move those, but I did anyway, because I'm that level of professional. Uh, right. 
let's do that. And then I was hoping I might be going slow enough, just ease a bit of brake on, that we can look out the window here and have a quick count of how many we're detaching. Uh, looks like six. All right, too much brake. Or uh, the brake is, is working perfectly. So there's the two we want, these two flatbeds. Uh, and then there's four extras sat on there as well. So I'm going to take all six, because then at least I've got my two. Uh, and then we'll, uh, we'll whiz those around to where they need to go. Alright, okay, yep, this looks, uh, this looks pretty reasonable. Points look like they're set correctly already. Alright, okay, this will work. And then what are you thinking with regard to the two that you need? Well, maybe just pull them up by a couple of feet, just to detach them from the, from the rest of the, the gubbins that's going on there. And, uh, and then, uh, and then ditch the four. No, you, you pushed that the wrong way, you know. There you go, give us some of that. Right, bring this back up. Uh, right. Where's it? Well, okay, what's changed now? That doesn't look right. It certainly doesn't look like what I just went past. <laughs> uh, okay, no, well, let's change that. Oh, no, it's the second one, isn't it? All right. Can we get to it from here? No, we're going to have to do that while in motion. Well, that's fine. I like a challenge. Uh, right, back into forwards. Brake to off. Uh, I have to point out, actually, that I mean, I've spent an hour uh, tootling around in this so far, and this is the first time I've come up with wagons respawning. So, uh, it is early access. Oh, isn't it, though? Um, and therefore, <laughs> therefore some, some weirdness always applies. But, uh, go on, over. Did I not do that? I thought I just set that. Did I misread it? That sounds like the more plausible thing that's going to have happened, doesn't it? Okay, no, no, nothing's changed. It's all still correct. You just, you just mis missed changing the points correctly. Okay. All right. Well, we'll do it as we'll, we'll do it as we go past. You don't need to be quite that aggressive. There you go. Just ease it off a smidge. And then everybody will be everybody will be peachy keen. Right, that second set's set correctly. Bring up that, change that. Right, okay, turn this off. No, no, turn this off. Put some brake on. Let's do it again, only better. Right, okay, doing it is doing it again, only better. Put it back in room and forwards. Yeah, that's neutral. That's forwards. That's give it a bit of throttle. Take it back off again. Good. Now, what I particularly like is that I'm not getting I'm not getting punished arbitrarily uh, for uh, for making a bit of a hash of this from time to time. Um, it's just kind of going. You know what you're supposed to do. Get on with it. Uh, if you want to take all day about it, that's that's entirely on you. Uh, I've no idea if there are AI trains on the network either. I would suspect not at the current time, uh, but I don't know that for a fact. Uh, right, okay, here we go. Here we are. That's it. I might be the last remaining train driver in the world. All right, well, that was that was a slightly better... Uh, uh, sli a slightly better connection. Right, we want six, so... Hold on, no, uh, one, yeah, two, three, four, five... Come on, keep going. No, that's four. Yeah, five. Yes, six. Double check your count there. Yeah. Spot a decoupleage. Right. Wang it the other way. All right, and then uh, break off. Move your load. All right. Okay. We we now have some. We now have some load. That's good. Right, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, I'm going to stop us again, as long as I'm not into the point. In fact, I won't be. It, it, this won't impact too greatly, and then we'll uh, we'll crop off the two that we want. Right, and now we'll shift this lot. Hopefully, having moved those two, 
uh, will uh, will prevent anything spawning in that in that siding. Um, I don't know whether it's going to work or not, but that's what I'm hoping. There you go. What how have we how have we done there? Okay, right. Well, we've left the right two behind. Uh, if I hop out the other side, if I, if I slow down a bit, bring up the points adjuster. Oh, you missed it. Oh, you haven't. There you go. And then, as soon as we've cleared that, we're going to flip that switch so we can just back it up. Never going to work. Never going to work. No, no, that's no good. Right. Going to have to go out and do it on foot. Haven't quite got enough visibility there. Uh, right, okay, good. No, no, see, we need the first one where it was, and then the second one needs to be shifted over. And that's, in fact, you have timed this very nearly to perfection. Another another foot and a half uh, would have cleared that. Oh, actually, you didn't need to clear that one either, so that's all good. We'll just bung it down here. This, thank you. All right. Miscounted. That's the. This was the first. This was the second one. Uh, the first one we were we were actually a little further clear of. Uh, right. Okay. Right. Okay. Bang it back in the other way and uh, take a break off and uh, let them have it. Right. There we go. This is uh, this is all good stuff. Uh, so yeah. So as you can see, if this is your kind of entertainment. Uh, in a, in a playing sense, where uh, you are somewhat master of your own destiny, uh, but you have an objective for, to fulfil, but it's up to you how to go about fulfilling it. Welcome aboard! Um, uh, technical nuances notwithstanding, uh, I'm rather enjoying this. Um, and I know that, uh, that just shunting stuff around isn't everybody's cup of tea, but actually I quite enjoy doing it. Uh, uh, you've I think you've gone early there, son. Yeah, you want a bit... Go, go a little bit further. Go on, keep it going. Get it get it down past the knuckle there, and uh, and then you, can, uh, you can come back the other way. Go get the ones you want. Hope nothing has respawned on top of them. And then maybe we'll be able to see a different piece of track. Right, we all clear? We're all clear. Connect, please. Thank you. Right, wang that that way. Give it some of this. Do some of that. Stand out on the foot plate here, ready to change the uh, switch over. In fact, let's stay on board, and then before we turn the switch over, we'll take it out of gear. There you are. Well, it's not out of gear. It's turn the speed off, because we can stand right on the back now and go. And that's that's the fella. That's the one. And bosh it. There you go. All right, and then back on here. Apologies for the uh, slightly jerky camera motion here. Uh, that's that's down to uh, down to a bit of mouse sensitivity. I'm trying to trying to keep my vision smooth where I can, uh, but obviously I've got a job to do, and therefore uh, the concerns of the viewing population are a secondary consideration. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's? No, no. That's right. You can ignore that first row. That's not you. Now, we don't want to nudge these two into the back of the rest of them. That's it. Jolly good. Yeah, this is all good. Right, there we go. Now, let's... Uh, are we going to go for a professional slowdown here? There you go. Yeah, actually, because this will this will tell me. Brakes on. Go on. Go on, a little bit further, a little bit further, just a, there you go, almost. So that's giving me a, a meter count on my uh, on my distance to go. That'll do. And spot on. Right, connect them up. No, what do you mean two? No, no, no. You, you should, we should be able to connect to two uh, to two there. There you go. Yeah, I've got me two. Hooray! Right then. Get, up, get me my station map. No, get me the job list. Where are we going? I've got those. Where do you want them? Uh, I'm pretty sure I'm still within 10 minutes. Or at least I was 20 minutes ago. Uh, right. Take them to... Uh, a couple following cars at station track SO9. That's what I've just done. 
Step two, uh, go to L05. Okie dokie. Uh, station map. Uh, L05 is over that way. Yep, that's fine. Okay, right. Uh, bang it in reverse. Uh, give it a bit of that. Give it less of this. And there we go. Right, I've got them. Done it. Yeah. I moved a set of phantom cars, did that. Uh, we stripped the first four off the edge, did that too. Oh yeah. Oh, we got it. We got it all happening. Uh, right now, then, can I from here? <laughs> right, this is going to be by far and eat away the uh, the easiest way to do this. Yeah, look at it. I am a total ruddy professional. Um, right, because we're going to want to go down. We're going down there. Right, and we're gonna we're gonna stick it under this uh, this dude, and that'll that'll fill us up with uh, with goodies. Um, but I figured that uh, that standing out here would be the best way to uh, to ping me points as I went past, because I'd actually be able to see the end of the train, uh, and then I'll sprint back up there, jump on, and uh, and everything will be good. Right, so we do want the first one. We want to head over that way, which is what it's doing already. Just need to switch this one. All right, okay. Now, there you go. Right. Oh. Right, thank you. Good job. Well done. Brakes on. Right, I'm going to have a quick look at the state. No, no, no. Let's get it going again. You've got, because you've got time. Uh, give it a little bit of that. Take that off. Uh, station map me. Right, L05 is the second junction. And we want to swing off to the uh, to the right. Okay, everybody seen that? Everybody, yeah, I'm giving you enough time to look at it. I'll tell you what, I'll leave it down there for you. Right? You can have a look at it in a minute. Whoop right, second one. Okay, fine. So we're going to we're going to get over here and then go uh, and then go uh, right, right. But not the first junction, second junction. Uh, bring up the junction remote. Oh, yes. This is a much more peaceful way to travel. Alright, so it's that one over there. Yep, yep, go on, get it, get it. That's it. Lovely. Yep. And then there should be a branch on that. Yeah, that should spur off as well. Ah, oh, yeah, there it is. Okay, so we're going to bung it under the uh, the right-hand side of this uh, this dispatchorium here. All right, that's good. All right, that's that one, and then that one as well. Go on, go on, get it, go on. I'd like to get back in the train in in, in a good amount of time to uh, to do this perfectly. It's got it. All right. Whoop. I'm taking no chances. I'm I'm whooping over the everything there uh, just to make sure that we uh, we have optimum uh, not falling off the train going on uh, the good news is we're only we're only maintaining speed at the moment we're not uh, we're not actually picking much up right so I now need to stop that within the uh, uh, within the dispatching bay and then we should be able to uh, to make some uh, make some beautiful magic right there we go lovely job getting it done oh yes oh and it took we took our time but uh but we got there in the end we're about to get there in the end that's that's a, probably a better thing to say uh right let's roll it from here keep your eye on the speed speed staying pretty much constant and then uh apply the uh apply the brakes that looks pretty good does look pretty good all right, now, I don't know how to do this next bit. All right, there we go. Load the cars with cargo. Well, I'm in the right place. Right, is there a something that I need to interface with in order to load the cars with cargo? Because I've, uh, I've not done that yet. Do I need to maybe back up just a little bit further? 
possibly we're underneath these these chutes here which i i imagine is the uh, uh press f to enter incidentally at the moment it's telling me i could just get on board the wagon um that's not it i think i'm gonna i'm gonna push it back a little bit further uh, and see if that triggers something. All right, here we go. Let's uh, let's try it. All right, break off. Just give it a dab. Just a little dab. There. That's it. And then break back on. Come on, tada me! Because at the moment all I've done is moved them. Do we think standing under here is wise? I don't know. Anything could come out of there. Hot suet pudding uh, could turn up out of there. So, I mean, it seems unlikely. LO5, yep, we're in the right place. Do I need to now press a button? I mean, I couldn't tell you whether that was likely or unlikely. Oh, hello, what have we got here? The, the loader versus unload. Oh, right, okay. Load. Oh, get in. Beautiful. Anything else? Uh, yeah, we've got steel billets. Steel bent plates. That's what we wanted. Thank you, unslash loader. Jolly good. Oh, that's... Oh, oh, I'm oh, I'm very pleased. Uh, right, okay. Yeah, wang that that way. And uh, and we're off to the... Uh, we're off to the races again. Alright, where are we going next? Speak to me. Uh, uncouple at 012. Alright, thank you. Alright, 012. Ah, uh, that's on the uh, that's on the right-hand side of the main switch route line there. Fine, I can do that. I've been up and down those before, and and so far, I, I, I you know if you haven't given me credit for this yet, you should do. Uh, so far, I haven't been up the wrong track. Give it time. Uh, it's a, it, it really is only a matter of time before I go up the wrong track, but uh, but as yet, I have not gone the wrong way. Anyway, we'll we'll soon see, I'm sure. Uh, right, okay. Now, as you can remember from earlier on in this video, uh, which you won't have tuned out of, um, I need to make 20 large in order to unlock the steam train. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to need to do some slightly more aggressive jobs to get to that point, I think. Um, but that's okay. I have a, I have a burgeoning uh, railway logistics empire here. And I'm, we're possibly overshot by a little further than intended. Right, okay, so we're back on the main line, and then bring up the station map again, and it's first one over. Okay, all right, fine. Uh, stick it into uh, forwards. Give it just a dab of throttle. And, uh, and we're going to try and do this first time. Was that enough? Not quite, just a little bit more. That'll do it. Right, can I just squeak round the side? I can't squeak round the side. Okay, right, now then, give me this. Junction remote. Bring it up. Change that. And then we want to change... Well, we want to make sure that we stay on the main line. And then the first one... So, the, that first set of points takes us off that way. We don't want that. Uh... We want the second one. There you go. Come on. Go on, I must have an angle on it by now. That's it. Stay on that side. And then the next one, we want to swing that over the other way as well. The third set look like they're already set correctly. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. I want to go and get back on board my choo-choo. There we go. Right, okay, yes, yes, yes. Right, good. Put that away. Go get back on the train. Don't fall off the side if you could possibly avoid doing so. That'd be, uh, that'd be very helpful. Okay, right. Master Engineer at work. Fear my lead skills. And there we go, that's that one. Good. Second one. Go on, do as I anticipated. Beautiful. Alright, smashing. Let's get this all the way through. And then uh, uh, whack that off. And 
Uh, we will we'll give that those wagons that are currently there a bit of a nudge, I suspect. But, uh, are we about there? Have we gone far enough? We have gone far enough. Okay, cool. Uh, right, detach. I think was the uh, was the order of the day there. Detach. Talk to me. Uncouple. Yep, I could do that. And then what's and that's it. Brilliant. Right. Job done. Let's get the train out of the way, just to sort of uh, remove any association uh, that the uh, the game may feel that we have with one another. Yeah, it's ain't nothing to do with me anymore. I've done my part. Spanking, right? And uh, stopping around here would be good, because then I could just go to the uh, go to the station and cash this monkey in. It's stopping. All right, off we go. Do, 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 do. Give me my money. Right, there we go. And then you go to the job validator, insert job booklet. Uh, there we go. Job complete. Money. Beautiful. All right, yeah, thank you. Money. Money. Put it in my wallet, maybe? Put it in the wallet at all? Do I need to... Maybe if I chuck that on the floor. Alright. Yeah, I just chucked a grand on the floor. And then... We do it like that. And the money goes up. Hooray! Uh, right. We'll take that. And uh, we'll stick it in the uh, bin. We'll stick it in the... Uh, bin. We'll stick it in the... Uh, bin. We'll stick it on the bin. There we go. That's it. Uh, so there you go. That is uh, your, your derail valley. I'll be back for a little bit more if you would like to see uh, a little bit more. I'll probably do a mission or two so that we're closer to getting the uh, uh, getting the, the steam on the go there. Uh, but we'll uh, but next time round we'll do uh, we'll do a longer mission so you can see something other than this junction. Uh, anyway, I've been Colonel Failure. Thank you very much for watching. Uh, I'll be back very soon with something similar. You should subscribe to make sure you don't miss it. And I'll catch up with you very soon. Cheerio! So there you go. Bit of Derail Valley action for you. Uh, now then, let's do a quick compare and contrast. Uh, is it a wholly authentic experience? Not really. Um, uh, it's, uh, it's, it's close. Uh, but it's a nod towards authenticity rather than being wholly authentic. And, uh, and it's also quite good fun. It's quite satisfying to do. Uh, exactly how that's going to manifest further down the line, I have, I have no idea. I'm going to find out, though. Um, secondly, what's secondly? Oh, yeah, uh, it's a bit buggy. <laughs> uh, wagons appearing out of thin air, for example. Um, yeah, that's that's a little bit uh, a little bit problematic, but uh, but nothing that we can't resolve in the fullness of time. Anyway, it's out on Steam now on early access, and uh, and thanks very much to the uh, the developers for furnishing me with a key uh, to go give it an initial spin. And after my initial spin, I had fun, so I'm going to go and give it a secondary spin, as you could probably imagine.